I am about to go back to camp festival so this is camp festival 2022 working with hotbox i don't know if you guys saw my last vlog from last year but it's a company where you can work at a festival either as a volunteer or a paid steward this year i'm working paid again and i've got free shifts so they're eight hours long i'm working thursday friday and saturday morning 8 a.m until 3 p.m i think but yeah i'm about to road trip by myself and this year i am completely going by myself working by myself putting up the tent by myself so yeah we're just gonna see how it goes but wish me luck let's go to camp festival i forgot to mention i am slightly ill i'm gonna stop off at mcdonald's first because i'm gonna have some lunch before i get to the campsite sign in and everything and then i'm there until monday i think who's playing rudimental example sister sledge the proclaimers i'm gonna try and vlog it might be more like time lapses little videos of the music and everything but yeah i'll try and vlog as much as possible let's see I've arrived at the festival site. It's in a different place to where I camped last year, so I completely like missed the turning driving in. So yeah, that was a palaver. Drove in, parked up, went down to the campsite. We're camped on a hill. I'll show you it in a second when I turn it around. I had no idea where I was going. I've already done my tent. That took me like a good hour. Luckily, there was some women to like help me. And then I've just like come back and forth to get my stuff. I'm here. I'm finally ready. Tents unpacked. Got my bands, got everything. And I can see the festival site and I can kind of like work out where we are. We're actually close to the yellow gate closer to the festival site i think i'll try and show you now but yeah um this will be the last time i come to my car because i've got everything out of it and now i've got to go do my airbed and everything but yeah i'm here my hair i did curl it this morning it's completely dropped out it is so hot got my car parking stuff and i'm ready i've got free shifts so i've got tomorrow morning i think i've got to get up at like seven to sign in it's like an eight hour shift i'm on gate tomorrow on friday and saturday i'm in the arena so that's either like patrolling the arena or working on like walkways and gates and stuff yeah let me show you like where i am parked and where the festival stuff like kind of is so i am parked in this like field right and then over here is the hot box campsite so i have to walk all along here all up there and that's where i'm parked like on a little hill part uh, i'm camped like on a little hill over there from what i can see that's the main festival bit over there that's all of the camping and then over here is like yellow gates so i feel like that's where i was working last year where all the camping was so from here i've probably got to just walk that way to get to the actual main campsite but yeah we've got our staff briefing meeting later on at seven so i'm gonna go chill out now have a drink some snacks maybe a nap who knows i'm just gonna go chill out but yeah before i check in with you Woo, cat festival <laughs> Had a shower, got sunburned, didn't eat for hours. Ate some really nice, expensive festival food. Now I've got to charge my phone and go to bed early. This is my view right now. What hacks are tomorrow? Rag and Bow Man, Benny Page, General Levi, Ed Solo. Excited for that.
really bad. Gonna go watch Earth, Wind and Fire, Dick and Dom, calling it. update it is the last day it's sunday today today is the last day of camp festival i haven't really like spoke to the camera at all over the weekend just because like i've been working my shifts it's been really hot i've got sunburn i think i've got a chest infection that's that has like progressively got worse over the weekend but like i have been going to the music each evening because my shifts have been like each morning but, yeah i thought i'd like talk to you guys a little bit about like what each of my shifts like consisted of and everything just because like in my last vlog that i did from camp festival last year i didn't really like speak that much about like what my shifts were anyone who's thinking of volunteering or working like with Hotbox or like another festival company it's really good like i was a page steward again this year you can just volunteer where you pay like a certain amount of deposit and you will get that back like after you've worked the festival so where i worked last year my deposit was a bit lower so like if you work consistently with the same company like you get that like a little bit of a discount on your deposit and then you get you get to choose your shift patterns and then the earlier you pay your deposit and like apply easier it is to get your first choice so i got my first choice which was really good which was gate indigo so that gave me three shifts um which are eight hours long each and it was really good because they were all earlies so i get to enjoy the music in the evening so i did my first one on thursday morning i got up like ridiculously early like 5 a.m because it was so hot in the tent like you can probably tell by my sunburn so i got really early that was on um, my shift on the gate so it was a yellow gate which is like the gate where everyone's arriving so it was a really busy morning we were just like on the wristbanding bit so like scanning people's tickets wristbanding them telling them to go where to go and everything so that was really good it was quite long you get like a half hour break which is quite good so like we sat there and had like a cup of tea for our break that day was like quite hot but like where i was under shelter it was fine and then that night who was on that night thursday night wasn't like music so it was just like a chill night so kind of went to the arena afterwards to get some food because the food stalls were open i had like this really good curry friday had another morning shift so got up early again but that was the arena so either static crossings and stuff so like directing people stopping the cars and like stopping people as cars go past and also like roaming the arena that was really good but that was the day i got sunburned because i literally came back my whole forehead is sunburned my face my hands i don't even know if you can see i like really sunburned and then the worst bit is probably my chest is really bad we're not going to talk about it didn't bring sun cream to die stupid like if you're going to camp festival wear sun cream <laughs> then i stayed in the arena for lunch i had chicken noodles amazing with one of my meal vouchers then for dinner i had um a chicken tikka wrap so good so good really recommend took pictures of each thing then we kind of went to like each of the music i met up with joe and lily who i met here like this weekend we went to rag and bowman was on the main stage i also saw ed solo benny page decline in the bollywood tent which is like drum and bass in the big top got one was DJing and Faithless was DJing so that was really good yeah like I saw bits of them I tried to film as much as possible probably didn't film like that much Joe Wiley as well was on main stage I got like a bit of that we went like right to the front and that was quite a late night like got to bed like half 11 like near midnight so it was very tired tired for like my next early morning shift but yeah yesterday was my last shift I was in the arena again for the last time it was with Lily yesterday so like we paired up and did the static positions also roaming around the arena really good almost got involved in the middle of like a nerf gun war between like 
thousands of kids so we escaped that quite quickly but yeah that was a really hot shift again like i was melting so i tried to stay in the shade as much as possible but for lunch i had some tomato pasta then came back to camp had a pot noodle and then i did go out to the music at like half nine ish because cool and the gang were on main stage earth wind and fire also and then dick and dom's massive rave in the big top which was just hilarious like i feel like it's hard because the little kids don't understand who dick and dom were but we do so we appreciated that and um, it was just really funny and it was manic in there they started to mosh pit which was a bit frightening today's my day off so done all my shifts it's really good time now i'm literally i'm sat in my car not going home but i woke up this morning went for a shower had a hot shower and then i've just been packing up my tent not everything just bits which i don't need because the walk's quite far and i did film it like from where i am sat in this car to where i'm camped but it's just like a hill and then another hill so bringing stuff back i was like sweating so i put the majority in my car so that tonight is um example rudimental on the main stage I'm really excited for that so i'm gonna go to that after eating dinner and then the fireworks finale so gonna watch a bit of that and then i'm gonna go to bed probably get up quite early to leave because i think it's gonna be quite busy so i'm gonna get up early get down my tent bring the rest of my stuff and go home but i'm gonna stop at the mcdonald's i think just to get some hash browns on my way back but yeah overall like it's been a really really good weekend i'll try film some more like tonight of the fireworks and stuff i really recommend and just wear sun cream that's all i can say from this whole weekend just don't get burned like me but it's been really good i know if like I've met like lots of really lovely people like that's the thing with hot box like you you come here even by yourself like to this year I came by myself to work here and I just met so many lovely people and it was a really good time but yeah I'm gonna go now because it's really hot in this car <laughs> I'm just 
watching hope you like and subscribe and yeah i will see you in the next vlog of whatever i do